recent study published in the journal of the National Cancer Institute revealed that men who were found to have prostate cancer, especially high-grade prostate cancer, had a higher level of omega-3 fatty acids in their bloodstream compared to men who were found not to have prostate cancer. The study was a kind of an after-the-fact study. They were actually looking at selenium and vitamin E to see if that had any impact on the development of prostate cancer. But after the fact, they looked at this, this blood levels of the omega-3 fatty acids, and they found that the men who had the prostate cancer had more of this in their bloodstream. Now, there's no proof, no evidence at all that the high levels of omega-3 caused the prostate cancer. Not at all. Um, so people unfortunately looked at this and said, oh my gosh, maybe if someone takes a fish oil supplement or eats a lot of fish, they're at higher risk for having prostate cancer. And that just has not been, been proven by this study. Many people have, been, have discussed with their doctor the health benefits. There have been many studies that have looked, studies that are well-designed, that are kind of forward-looking studies that have looked at omega-3 fatty acids like, like eating cold water fish and taking fish oil supplements and have found that they may be beneficial in terms of reducing your risk of heart disease or decreasing inflammation or, or reducing other disease processes. So if you have discussed that with your doctor and you're on fish oil capsules now, this study should not change your mind and should not dissuade you from continuing on with your fish oil. As with all supplements, more tests, more research needs to be done to determine if supplements are safe and if they're effective at doing what they're doing. But this study did not in any way prove that fish oil or eating a lot of cold water fish caused prostate cancer. Stay tuned and we'll look for further studies down the line. That's a minute for health.